Hey everybody, welcome back to Whisper Rose. I took uh, the western path that took went up the hill from the cave I came out of and noticed this little, barely visible little cave. And sure enough, it's a dragonfly nest. Looks like we're going to have to continue, contend with three of them. So let's go ahead and hit the first one, and you know what? They're getting a torrent. Don't really want to deal with them. And that takes them out quite handily. And that appears to be droppings. All right. So you'll see the route I took. In reverse, I suppose. Going to see if I can get past with the minimum of fighting. Not going to make it past these guys. But they go down pretty quickly. A little bit of overkill that can't really do anything about. At least we're collecting herbs and stuff. And from here, I head a little bit north, and here's the cave I came out of. Yeah, it's just the going through the nest and being expected to just kind of wander through an area I've already been in, taking an inobvious route. Um, that just. That just doesn't seem like good game design with, you know, without any kind of clue if I'm on the right track or anything. Past the, you know, you don't want eggs. Which, well, obviously I'm looking for droppings. Droppings aren't eggs. Um, there wasn't really anything. I just know I'm supposed to look in a dragonfly nest. And honestly, I could have wandered around here for much longer. Because there was no clear indication that there were other nests. At least, uh, you know, it could have been, once I found the eggs, them going, Oh, hey, this isn't what we want. Let's find another one. Would have been useful, made this a little less annoying. But this does bring me out pretty close to the exit. I, of course, need to fight another dragonfly. But one hit from each of us. And it goes down in short order. Hopefully, I can avoid any nasty fights back in the Butterfly Hills. And for that matter, hopefully I can find my way back to that pass. Because as we've seen, my sense of direction is not so great. I get very easily turned around. Alright, and this is the store thingy. I don't think it has anything I want. Goodness, come on. That's a cliff. And a small horde of bees. Let's attack one that hasn't attacked yet. Did I attack the right one? Alright. And a torrent. So they, of course, go down just as easily as before. Let's see, is this the route? I certainly hope it is. I'm getting... I don't even want to fight you. Let's follow these flowers and head... Right. Got completely bungled up there. 
Alright, let's do a break melee shield. Oh. It helps the tooth target. And we'll just use a regular attack there. Man, he takes a serious beating. I think one more attack cycle should do it. There we go. Give me your orbs. And let's head down this path. Hopefully, yeah. This, no. No, this is not it. Oh, uh, I wish, oh, how I wish I had a sense of direction. Perhaps, no. This route has nothing for me, actually. Nothing but the mushroom that I had to kill. So that only leaves to the west. Up to quit, get off that mushroom. Hello, bees. Now, does this kill? Yeah, it does. Am I going to get my attack off before he gets his big attack off? Yes, I am. Okay. Excellent. Well done. Alright, so up and around. I still don't know how to get up there. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. I'm not getting past him. No way, no how. Oh, that didn't work. That, however, works quite nicely. At least they gave me the appropriate tools to handle the enemies I'm facing. Alright, so up and around this way, I think. Now up around the flower. You throw the poop somewhere really far. Of course, I've been going through butterflies like this entire time, I'm pretty sure. I guess maybe they're supposed to be just higher, I don't know. Northwest, Ladybug Village. Excellent. Let's avoid the mushroom guy. Ooh, Drawing Staff 2. I actually bought a few of those at one of those four uh, converting doodad places. Oops. Well done, Coos. Um, attacked the bottom one? Sure, why not? Dang it, I never choose the right one. Oh well. Torrent takes care of them nonetheless. I really hope I can do hope I can do something useful with all these bloody wings I'm getting. Uh northwest. Let's open up a chest first. Sweet salve, nice. I also bought some of that. And some antidote. But I really just want to get... Oh, wait. What is this? Oh, orb vendor. Uh, let's do nothing. Check my health. Um, you know, honestly, I feel like it's presence here. It's suggestive. And that's pretty cheap, to be honest. I don't want to buy anything. Let's do a quick, quick save. And head north. More of the same, of course it is. 
Um, is there any way to avoid this mushroom guy? I do not... Yeah, it does not look like there is. Go on, bring it, mister. Okay, so... Let's try a magic shield break. And... Gust. Uh, that did decent. Better than what she does normally, right? Just gotta remember to keep the gust up. Oh, he's flashing. He is flashing. He's flashing red also, and that's kind of throwing me off. Excellent. Keep up the melee shield break. It does more damage, so... I don't see any reason not to. Ooh, wine yeast. Let's make wine. That sounds like the way to go. We must... We have to enter the cave somewhere up ahead north. And into the caves, we have to follow the tunnel west. There's a teleport device there that takes us out of Butterfly Hills. To the place where all that smoke is coming from, right? Yeah, I hope the ladybugs are alright. Their village is there. Ladybugs? You'll see. Will I? Uh, another one of those guys. So let's peek this way. Ooh, a sign. Northwest Butterfly Caves. I think I actually want to go this way. Ah, you cannot reach me, but ba 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 bees, wasps. This is not the s same. I hope not the same. All right, hello, Mr. Scorpion. Bring it on. Uh, maybe if I improve Sharp Slash, it would be better. I don't know. Okay, he's flashing red. Yeah, it just does less damage for more mana. How should we do on a normal hit with broken defense? Seven? Yeah. And she's almost out of mana, so definitely yeah. This device takes us outside of the butterfly caves and near the north exit of Butterfly Hills. It's a one-way trip. To go back, we have to walk. Should we use it? No. Um. I don't really know what I'm doing in here. I don't know, maybe there's something useful? Probably not. Oh, come on, you can't even hit the freaking bat. And the screech, of course. And I might end up having to turn back if this cave proves a little too difficult. Um, but for now, we're just going to keep wandering around, see if we come across any interesting armor. Oh, I actually got to fight him separately. Excellent. A little more fluff around having to deal with uh, battle intros, but... Oh, you brought a friend. Okay, then. Alright, who... Okay, the flashing one is attacking, so... Attack there. There, and... Voila. Fewer attack cycles, I think. My rough math on it earlier seemed like it was quicker to do it that way, so. I'm not. I'm going to try not to overthink it, I should say. More than I probably already have. Hello, bats. 
Where do you keep getting these friends? I wonder if... No, I don't... I didn't see any options to just upgrade regular attacks. So I'm assuming... Oh, nice. I'm assuming that probably just comes from stat increases. And as much... Uh... Oh boy. As much as I would like... I almost feel like... Uh, what was I saying? I completely lost my train of thought. Uh, maybe I should head to the Butterfly Village first? Or the... Ladybug Village? That would probably be a sensible thing to do. So let's head this way, play with more wasps. It look like bees. Oh, let's just torrent them. Yeah, they're actually going to sting me a pretty good bit. And I should get Melrose a bit of MP. Um, let's see, oh, this sweet salves. Butterfly powder, yeah, let's use that. And just... Oh, I guess I'm out. Alright, that'll do. What are my levels, actually? 11, 11. Nice. More drawing salve. I have a feeling I've entered into places I just should not go for... Ugh. For you, huh? Well, that answers at least one question. Well, not so much answers, but... Oh, wow, they didn't take him down. Let's hit somebody again. I actually did a fair bit of damage. Well, the question I was talking about is how many foes, or were you limited to just three? It doesn't answer how many foes we have, but it does limit it. Uh, I'm getting so tongue twisted and brain twisted for that matter. Yeah, come on, just bring everybody along. It at least raises the limit that I know of. I might have actually attacked the right one. Yes, I did. Of course, they're almost going to be dead. I kind of think I need more speed for Helena. If only I knew where I was going at this point. Oh, excellent. Oh, not so excellent. The Ladybug Village, what has happened to it? Poor ladybugs, we have to look for survivors. Alright. Do I go into the... No. Is it going to be obvious? Ooh, a chest. And I actually found something other than just... music in the chests. Or if the chests I find in areas are just the soundtracks to that area. Ooh, upgrade. Um. I kind of wish... 
I could just amongst round I can't. Uh what's this way? Okay, so back this way. I think I want to oh boy. Buff up. Um okay, unlock Gust already. Yeah, this is what I want to upgrade just a bit. Just for those times when I don't, you know, I'm not able to cast. What? Oh, it takes two to do that. That takes three, that takes one. Okay. What is this? I don't know. Ah, sharp slash. Like, maybe... Really, that costs six? I don't... I kind of would prefer to get those points back, to be honest. Uh, let's just... I don't... It's not really for the damage that I use it. I should probably save. And uh, we'll have to finish exploring the butterfly or the ladybug village next episode, guys. So, until then, catch you later.